Welcome to Live in Okinawa. Hello. I'm here too. <laughs> Today we have no plans. We are really just going to go for a drive with you guys. I feel like we never really have a plan. Oh, we have a basic plan usually. Do we? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we have an idea of where we're going. This time, we don't even know where we're going. Do we, though? So, we're just going to drive through Okinawa. You guys can join us. Hey, CW. We'll talk and drive. Joe, hello. Hello. Your weather report's coming at you live. <laughs> Very hot today, it seems. Hi, Linda. Hey, Linda. Okay. So, as... Hi, Oliver. Oliver, how's it going? Okay, let's see here. So, just like quite often, we're starting in front of a Lawson. Oh, it's Pokemon Community Day. <laughs> oh, Matt. I know, Thanks, he, he always gets his uh, Eric. It's Eric. <laughs> Eric, I always say that. I always say that. Sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's so easy. The I H know. throws me off. I know. I know. Hi everyone. Oh, two Cynthia's. It's a Pokemon community day. What is this? Oh, two Cynthia's. Oh yeah. Same double. All right, so we're just kind of driving today around. You guys are just gonna chill with us, drive with us. Hi, Ellen. Let's do it. We're starting a little bit <coughs> earlier than normal, I think. We'll see how it goes. I know, because there's a few people last, uh, l the few, last few videos we've done, they really were like, oh yeah, I'm, uh, I'm glad I caught you right before I went to bed. And I'm like, okay. Oh yeah. We should probably start a little bit earlier, especially for the East Coast folks, you know. So this is, uh, is this 224? What? What street is this? Oh, I don't know. Um, this is a very what main up, road. <laughs> I'm getting used to it. He shouldn't. He shouldn't have to get used to it. <laughs> Bowley. What we snacking on? We just ate. We had some Lawson. I had the uh, egg and... It was really good. Egg teriyaki. Yeah, egg. egg chicken teriyaki sandwich. Yeah. I'm glad you're on earlier. Works better for me. Thanks. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, we should do it earlier. Yeah. We've been sort of trial and error the times of like when people can get on. I yeah, because uh, when we're earlier enough for the East Coast folks, then we're too early for the people in Hawaii. <laughs> so it's like... But the Pacific time people, the Pacific time zone people, they're like right in the good spot either way. Yeah. <laughs> they're the true winners right now. <laughs> I think there is a decent amount of people that watch us from Hawaii though. Yeah, I can only think of two, which is Gina and Ray. This is the first live I've been able to catch in about two months. What? Nico? Really? Oh, I feel like I see you on here all the time. I haven't seen Nico in a while. Oh, okay. <laughs> This is uh, 75. You are correct, Billy. Oh, yes. That's it. Yes, we are on 75, heading south. Yeah, I was thinking I might just do a loop-de-loop. -loop. Just go the long way, past Rycom, go towards American Village, drive around American, just kind of like hang out for the day. <clears throat> <laughs> Hello, you two. I always remember where you got your Pokemon cards from. <laughs> Collector's Choice San Jose. That was it. That was it. That's where I got them all. Did you end up getting them all? Uh, I know you got the Charizard. Yeah, I did. I do have the full basic set, finally. I'm missing maybe just a couple in Jungle and a couple in Fossil. But after those sets, I didn't Joe, do any. Joe so. actually plays the card game. Oh, really? I've played it a few times, but I definitely more collected them. 
which I think I'm more happy about because I watched this video on YouTube um, where this guy appraised people's Pokemon collections and the people that played Pokemon a bunch, their cards were like all trashed and they're like, yeah, this is worth like $10 for the whole set. <laughs> And then the people that had like the nice collection were a couple hundred. I walk this street so many times. You have 97 people watching. Oh, wow. Yeah, there is a lot of people. We didn't even share it or anything. Did one of you guys share it somewhere? I've been scheduled to work during the lives every Saturday, and I'm super glad this opened with Pokemon. Oh. <laughs> we like our Pokemon. Yep. Wait, hold on. Evan! Hey, Evan, he's the owner of Bacon Bar. He used to... Uh, oh, okay. Uh, Mongoose, which Bacon turn. Bark is really, really good. He says turn right. Is he trying to take us to Bacon Bar? <laughs> bacon Bar is back there. Just kidding. <laughs> I have to take you to Bacon Bar. Bacon Bar is really good. If you guys are on the island, look up Bacon Bar. That place is legit bomb. I'm missing some hibachi. Here, can you... Time is good. I did. Oh, I shared it. Oh, okay. Thanks, Thank Linda. <laughs> Thank you. I think you uh, got start. us a lot of viewers. <laughs> Earlier start means less traffic. That's very true. Yeah, this is going really well. And there's a lot of people in here right now. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Okinawa, if you're not here. If you don't live here. Like, I think some of you... Some of you are here, but... <laughs> head down 329 to... I'm pretty 3, sure. 4, 16. I'm pretty sure that's the location of Bacon Park. Oh. <laughs> but I'm telling you, that he, he makes good stuff. We get notified when you start. Oh, thanks, Enrich. I'm just kidding. That time I was joking. <laughs> Trust me, he still doesn't know how to say my name after eight years of being together. Cat. <laughs> I shared it with. Cat. <laughs> I shared it with about six uh, Kubasaki alumni groups. Oh wow! Wow, thanks guys. I should share. It Thank with you for sharing. I should share it with my... Uh, we share it sometimes, just for people to find us, but now you guys are doing it, I can so... I use my phone to read the comments. To what? Read the comments. Oh, yeah. That's easier. Oh, my gosh. I missed so many comments. Oh, it's Alicia's birthday? You know what oh, no. I would like to do? Is maybe do, like, a... a um, what is it? A mukbang thing at maybe Bacon Bar. Because he has really good food. Oh, yeah. I also want to cool. do that at, like, Sam's by the Sea. That would be fun. All right, let me try and read your comments, guys. I missed Oki. You're not going to read it on that? Yeah, this one's not showing me all of it because I just went in. Watching from Norfolk, Virginia. Wow. So what time is it in... What, Virginia should be like, what, 8 or something like that? Uh, I'm just completely guessing. I know it's somewhere like that. I don't even know what time it is here, actually, so... Uh, yeah, I don't know what time it is. <laughs> Much <anymore>. less Virginia. <laughs> I thought we started early, but I don't know if we actually did. Yeah, I think we did. We started at like... I don't know. Like 10? 10 no. something? Because when we left the house, it was... Like, it was 10? Yeah, so it's probably about 30 minutes to 11, if anything. Great day for a diver. Looks like a nice day. What a beautiful day. Kubasaki. Spot. Everyone's cheering for Kubasaki. Oh no! I'm a Kadena alum. Well, I didn't even graduate Kadena, but I went to Kadena. Kubasaki's the one with all the misfits, right? Um, it was back in my day, oh. but now it's kind of flopped. Now Kadena is kind of a misfit school, and Kubasaki is the well-to-do. <laughs> right now, we're on 75. Actually, this is uh, gate 2, right on the right here. Yeah. 
So if you guys know Gate 2 Street. We just passed BC, we're about to pass Gate 2. Yeah, you can see it here. The Kadena Gate 2 entrance is right down this road and this is all the shopping and stuff on the right side. It's uh Panthers are cool too. <laughs> we're actually going to be on this road. We'll be on this road, but uh, we're going to be passing by Kubi. Is the price really worth it? Oliver. I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. That sounds good, Kit, since we can't eat inside restaurants right now. Oh, that's right. Ah. Are, are you guys still on restrictions? Looks different than 2002, huh? Oh, yeah, for sure. This... Gate 2 is so run down, it's crazy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Joe's, uh... Yeah, he can't eat. All the military members here can't do anything right now. Mm. Mm. Yeah, my friend went, to, or my hairdresser went to American Village the other day, and she said it was so weird because there was, like, no Americans. No Americans? Just filled with Chinese? No Chinese either. No Chinese? Oh. No, we don't have tourists. Oh. It's just locals right now. Oh, that's kind of nice. I mean, it, it probably sucks for the Americans here, because <laughs> they're here. <laughs> Savannah, Georgia. Oh, I see. It's 940. It's trying to reconnect? I didn't see it. It was right in front of us. It was like three Did it have flowers girls? and stuff? Oh, and I missed it? 9.40 p.m. in Virginia. Oh, okay. I was a little off. All right, I didn't realize it was that late in um, parts of America yet. Freeport, Florida. I left at age 15, 1971. Talk about a huge difference. Oh, yeah, I bet it's a lot different. Yeah, especially like Gate 2 Street. It was hopping a lot more back then. Where are you guys driving at? Yeah, right now we're on the main intersection of uh, Gate, two. Gate 2. That's uh, you go right. it's the Coza, Coza Music Town. Town thing, which, I mean, it depends on when you've been here. You may not even know what that is, but you probably do know Gate 2 Street. Let me see if I can show you guys. I like to do like... Yeah, straight down that way is Gate 2 um, entrance for Kadena. We started at 10.30. All right, thanks, Joe. My new Saturday night go-to. But we do this every Sunday. No, I'm just kidding. Well, we do do it every Sunday. Every Sunday, if you guys want to tune in. Yeah, Saturday is uh, Saturday for the state, Sunday for us. Yeah. 1990 to 1994, we love it there. Phoenix, Arizona, 6.45 p.m. Kadena alumni. Didn't graduate there, but... What year did you go to Kadena? Oh yeah, that's Nico. Oh, that's right. Nico did go to Kadena. You guys went there about the same time too, right? Uh, I don't know. Because you would have been 07, right? Graduation. Yeah, so I went she didn't graduate from it either. I went 04. 04, 05, you were there? No, maybe just, yeah, 04, 05, somewhere along there. I don't remember. Oh, Kubasaki was the only high school when I was there. Yeah, Kubasaki's uh, older than Kadena. I see. That makes sense. All right, we're going to just Georgia. jump into the street. Great. Do they still have Koza? Yeah. I haven't been exposed since 1975 when we went there to the expo. Wow, you guys, this is uh, awesome. There's a lot of you watching right now. That's good. So for those of you that aren't in Okinawa, get to see how different it is now. Unless you were just here, then it's probably not that different. I'm trying to scroll through your comments. There's so many of you now. <laughs> Blue Bridge is gone. Man, 
I was stationed on Kenzer back in 2008. Oh, Kenzer? Face, ba- face masks are mandatory. New Han... Hondover? Over? Colorado? Face masks in Okinawa aren't mandatory, but people wear them anyways. Dang, you guys. You guys are all over. Telling me where you're from and where... Uh, we're passing Where you by guys Plaza, were stationed. Plaza House uh, Shopping Center, which is... Oh, yeah. Is a lot a... of people from back in the day will probably know that, because that's like OG place. Like an OG OG. Oh, right. Yeah, the shopping center. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to take the phone off. This is the one that's... Um... You guys will see. A lot of you guys will know, because we're close by uh, Foster now. And we'll be passing by Foster, but... Yeah, if you guys haven't seen, uh, there's a giant mall here, too. Wait. Yeah, that's right up here. Rycom? Yeah. So this is Plaza House. So, here's Plaza House Shopping, if you guys remember that. That's what it looks like right now. And there's Shakey's Pizza. KFC there. And then if you look right in front, this is Rycom Mall. It's the largest mall in Okinawa now from Aeon or Jesco if you guys haven't been here in a while. Depends when you get, I mean, I don't know how long all this stuff has been here, but this has only been here since 2015? Somewhere in there. So that's a giant mall. Here, let me put you guys back up here. Actually, I'm gonna take this phone case off just in case my phone gets too hot. Shakey's Corn Pizza. Love the Chinese restaurant at Plaza. Yeah, Used that to live place there on the left house golf course. In Washington, D.C. Grew up there 92 and 2002. Wow. 10 years. You must really miss it, Michael. It's a good, good chunk of, I don't know how old you are, but that's a good chunk of anyone's life. It's a decade. That's about as long as I lived in California. Yeah. Rogers is still at Plaza. It is. Yeah, I know. That place has been around for ages. There's Rogers. Yeah, everyone's talking about Rogers. Shakey's Pizza has a fun buffet. I like Plaza Shakey's. House looks the same as in the 70s. Uh, yeah. Oh, wow. I look... It does. It hasn't changed that much. It's Jesco and will always be in my heart. Thank you. <laughs> I can always tell the OGs when they know it's Jesco and not Aeon. Rycom, is that where Owase Golf Course used to be? Yes. Oh, yeah. I didn't know that. There was a golf course here? Yeah, it was a pretty big one. Okay. Is it the largest? I thought Parco was bigger. I mean, we just did a... We yeah, just... I think someone, someone in the comments knows this. I know Joe knows that. Um, I forgot which one was actually bigger. I think Parco has more stores. But Rycom's technically like bigger square footage. Uh, but I don't remember exactly. There's that old A and W over there too. Oh yeah, here let me try and show you guys this. That's an old AMW? Yeah, it's been around for ages. So oh, you guys and then another that. favorite of people's would probably be just don't keep hold on to it. Okay. Uh, Rose Garden right here. Oh Rose Garden. Where's it's that? Oh Rose this Garden. one right here. You guys remember that? And keep the phone on you because we're about to pass Kawasaki. Okay, I'm gonna keep showing you guys. This is crazy. There's so many comments. I was back there in 2017, didn't recognize anything. Oh, yeah. How long were you gone for? 2017. Oh, I saw someone post Coco's Curry from Southern California the other day. You know, yeah. I went to eat Coco's Curry in L.A. when we went down there. 
Yeah, we've had Cocos in SoCal. And it's not the same. I don't think it's that different. You were, you were the one who pointed out how different it was. <laughs> you know, when we were in Thailand, it was extremely different. No, but the, uh, the LA one, you were like, wow, this, this tastes more like a... Uh, like the packet ones. Oh, you're right. I, I do remember saying that. Yeah, it's not quite the same. I mean, it was, it was, it was haunted good. hotel. So, Jeremy, fun fact about the haunted hotel. I did a video on that. Yeah, Kit did a two-part video on our YouTube channel about it, about searching for the haunted hotel. Spoiler alert. Not going to tell you anymore, but. Oh, okay. <laughs> there's a there's a twist at the end there's if if you're expecting. Uh, the haunted hotel. I think you're to I'm, I'm already like yeah. rooting the. I'm not gonna say anything, but John dies at the end. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much how it works. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like the spoiler to every movie. Oh, here Kubasaki's on the. Oh, line. okay. Here's Kubasaki. All right. Kubasaki, so the only high school for you guys, right? Well, this isn't the high school, is it? Yes. That's just Kubasaki. Wait, is it? Yes. High school? High school, I think, coming up, yeah. It's in there, I don't know if you guys can see it. It's because there's the oh, ROTC okay. building and stuff. There's Kubasaki. Yeah. It's hard to see. I think we pass by kind of fast, but the Kubasaki There's an honor school. ROTC building. And then you got Foster across from it. trying to show you guys here. Oh, Foster. and then that's Foster over there with a, was that, what, what was that restaurant there? That was a Popeyes. Oh, Popeyes? Oh. Excuse me, the BX, or Watch the Exchange. Out. Oh. The Exchange right. is right there. Oh, okay, that's the BX. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's the, the PX. PX? PX. With a Taco Bell and a Subway. Oh, and then this side. That's the so close to Avia Volcano, Robin. My school, we've been there so many times, I want to see your video. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you guys can check out our videos, too. Um, Kit and I are both YouTubers, and she makes a video every day. The haunted hotel one, though, is probably buried because I've made a video every single day. Yeah, Kit's a daily a vlogger here in Okinawa. It's not always about Okinawa, it's just, you know, about her. But if you want to check it out, um, here, I'll leave a comment for our YouTube channels. I make a video every other day, in fact, and today, Kit makes one every day. In fact, today is my 200th vlog. Oh, yeah, guys, by the way, that's... For those of you that actually watch the vlog, it's very exciting because Kit's 200th vlog is today. Yep, 200th vlog of the year. 200 days in a row. Since January 1st, she's made a vlog, a video on her channel. And, which actually means today is also the 200th, 200th day of the year, right? Anyone remember Casa Taco outside Courtney? Uh, actually, Casa Taco is the one my uncle says he wants us to try. It's right outside Courtney, and it's still oh, there. Oh, that's the one? We haven't tried it yet. I actually do want to try it. But... I will drive the six hours down to social just for Coco's. Oh, yeah. Oh, social. Why did I say SoCal. Yeah. Kubasaki had four football teams. That's huge. That's a lot. Who all played each other. Same with basketball and baseball. Wow. Almost to King Taco. Did we pass that? No. I think we might have. Oh, congratulations to you. Oh, thank you. Thanks for the tour. Lived there 65 to 70. Visited briefly in 2005. Did not get around much. Missed the island. I'm trying to reconnect. Are we? People are saying Casa Taco is amazing. We're gonna maybe we could do a, uh, a 
video at Casa next time. Yeah. That would be hey guys, hold on. I'm trying to save you. I don't know if my phone's overheating or if it's just the connection here. Going towards Yomitan. 200. Casa Taco's still there. I'm so proud and happy for Kit's 200. Congratulations, Kit. This is my birthday stream since next week before Saturday. Nico. Oh, nice. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> wow, people really like Casa Taco. Yeah, I guess we're going to have to try Casa Taco next week. Trying to get a hold of some special people that live there. So Help. well. Is it pricey? Oh, Casa Taco. Oh yeah, is Casa Taco pricey? I don't know, I've never been. Oh sorry, I'm like facing you guys up while I'm reading the comments. Hopefully you guys are still there. Let me know if you could still uh, hear us and see us. It says we're connected, but I don't know. Okay, here, put you guys back up here. Hopefully it'll work. Give me some hearts and thumbs up if you guys are still here, if it's working. Oh, okay, starting to get comments now. Really miss Okinawa. So we're here, we're gonna, oh good. We're gonna go ahead and, we're passing Futemo right now. Oh wow, a lot of likes and hearts. All right, you guys can hear me. We're passing Futemo right now, and then so, we're gonna go past uh, Okinawa American Village and Tsunabe. I'm trying to show you guys, but yeah, that's, Tsunabe and American Village and stuff down there. Can you see the, uh, I don't see the Ferris wheel. Can you not see it from here? I don't see it. It's really built up, like. Yeah, it used to oh, be. Oh, there's the Ferris wheel. It nice. used to be like so there, you know what I mean? But now you can't you can barely see it. Yeah, even when I first came here, my first trip here was, uh, what was it, 2013 or something? Yeah, something like that. And American Village was pretty small, but now there's just giant buildings surrounding that Ferris wheel. You like can't even see the Ferris wheel anymore. Oliver likes Casa Taco too. Oh, we're gonna have to try Casa Taco. He's talking in third person as well. <laughs> Oliver liked Casa Taco too. <laughs> I miss the ocean. Was there from 01 to 08. I miss that place every day. So many memories. I lived in Tsunabe. Hard Rock. We we'll used to go to Hard Rock Bar. We'll be passing by Tsunabe, actually. So, are we still on 75? Or did we turn off? I don't think we turned No, we didn't turn off. Is this still 75? I believe so, yeah. Yeah, so we're still on 75. You guys want to know where we're at? We're about Miss to hit 50. Toddy Station. Eight. We're about to hit 58. Nine. I got lost going to Mihama. I only found it because of the Ferris wheel. Yeah. I've always wanted to visit. Oh, Christopher, have you actually been to Okinawa before? It says he's always wanted to visit after I got out of the military. Oh, oh, I see. Come back and visit. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. 93 for me, yes. There wasn't many places to go back in 74 and 78. Alright, we are on 58. Is this 58? Oh, this is the... This is the road. The Okinawan Main Road. Welcome to 58. There's Foster to the right. This should be a tour guide. And if you look over to your right, back to the commissary is coming out. you will see Foster. I didn't grow up here like you did, and these guys did. I've just visited many times. Now I live here, which is cool, but. Chi 
Chi-Chi's bar is coming up to the left. Chi-Chi's bar. Boys, something you'll want to see. <laughs> Maybe girls too? No judgment here. No, no judging. Oh, there's Burger Bear. Oh, wait. Parking lot. <laughs> there's Chi Chi's right there. Oh, there's Burger Bear. There's Chi Chi's. And Chi Chi's and a Lawson's right next to Lawson's. That Lawson's is probably busy at night. Oh, yeah, at night. Maybe that's why a lot of Americans like the Lawson's. It's right next to Chi Chi's. Are you going towards Naha? We are going towards, actually right now we're passing, going pa towards Sunabe area. Ooh, we'll that is shining my eyes. What we could do is uh, maybe stop by Ocean and see, have everyone see the ocean too. Yeah, there's a good view. Hi Sean. I'm jealous of you guys, enjoy the island for all of us. I will give that a like, Jeremy. Oh yeah, if you're My from 57 to 60, it definitely is. You were here when it was still under American control. Oh yeah, that's quite a bit different then. Oh here, if you go, oh here. There's a Cocos. There is a Cocos. Love that Cocos. Here, take it down. So I don't know if most of you guys are gonna see, but Hamby Town's coming up for some of you OG. There's like OG levels, but one of the OG levels you guys will see up Hamby Town. Right OG. Here. I think the real OG levels like of people. Hamby oh yeah. Town. For anybody who ever remembers Hamby Town before American Village was a thing. It's OG for you, but then like the real OGs are like, that wasn't even there. This was a dirt road when I was there. <laughs> This was ocean when I was there. <laughs> There's definitely levels of OG. Yeah. <laughs> like one of my favorite restaurants, Pikuri Donkey. I love Pikuri that Pikuri Donkey. Favorite ramen place coming up too on the left. That's Joe's favorite ramen. We used to go to the seawall every Sunday morning. They're from 89-93 and from 2004-2008. Left in summer of '89. Need to go back there. Um, you guys too. There's a lot of people in this chat. You guys may be able to reconnect with each other as well. We've had a few people reconnect through our chats. Yeah, we've had like students connect with teachers and like people that were stationed here the same times as them. I don't know. It's really it's, cool. Or even. Uh, oh, the weather's turning. Yeah, is it gonna start so to get stormy? <laughs> I wanted to show you guys the ocean before it all like went to crap. Who are our two hosts? Oh yeah, we should flip the camera. Oh. Yeah. For a second here. Hello. Hi. If you guys are new here, I'm Kit. This is Matt. I'm Matt. We do this live every Saturday for you guys. It's Sunday here though in Okinawa. Yeah. Unless you're in Okinawa, then it's Sunday. And uh, we're YouTubers. Okinawa YouTubers, I guess. Yeah. She does a daily vlog. And uh, I do one every other day. Oh, Blue Seal coming up. And there's Blue Seal. Y'all know Blue Seal. So just showing you guys. Blue Seal to the left. Born, what's her? It was born in America, raised in Okinawa. Yes. Like a lot of you. Uh, oh, this is, um, yeah, cool. So we're going through American Village now. So if you guys miss Mihama, I graduated high school in 1974. Okinawa has changed a lot. Uh, thanks for sharing, Kit and Matt. I used to live at Goodwill store. It was the oh, Best yeah. Buy of Okinawa. The Goodwill store is actually still, I think it's still around. The Best Buy, I should do a video of that. That is like such a video. I actually did a video of uh, 
You did it on Best Todenki. Yeah, Best Todenki, and I called it the Best Buy of, of Japan. Because not, it's not Okinawan, but... Um, thanks for this, you guys just... You guys just made my day. Hama and Higa Island was my peaceful place. Oh yeah, we do lives there sometimes too. Yeah, we could go next We've, week. In fact, last week our live was at Hamahiga. Yeah, we did. We actually just spent the day at the beach and took everybody with us. Yeah. Which, By the way, if you guys miss any of these lives too, they're all on this page, Live in Okinawa. Yeah, they're archived. Yeah, on the left side you can click the Live tab and go through all of our old videos if you ever want to rewatch them. We've been it's fun to be here with you guys though. So here's the old, or the Jusco, it's called Aeon now, but OGs will call it Jusco. I'm sure you guys recognize this, maybe, if you've been here in the last 15 or so years, 20 years, yeah, maybe 20 years. Ferris wheels on the right. There it is. I walked to the Give street. us some... Give us some love, some hearts, if you recognize this place. There's Dragon Palace right there. Y'all, a lot of kids will know Dragon Palace. Oh. This, like, this was my stopping ground. Like, I spent so much time here. Here's Tony Roma's and Caprichosa's. And there's the Mihama 7plex. Mm -hmm. And this is the main intersection here Dragon with the Ferris Palace. wheel. But some I'll of you, show guys you guys around. who recognize Mihama will probably it'll, it'll blow your mind at how different it looks now. Dragon Palace, Make Man, the Monkey Store. That actually, it makes a lot of sense for uh, the Americans that come here and can't read the katakana. It's like, it's the Monkey Store. Yeah. I'd imagine that's why it got that name. So there, this is all new, guys. This is... Uh, just opened in March, I think. This year, all of this is brand new. And as you can see, we're right across from the backside of Sega, which is on this side. So you can see the back of Sega here. And a lot of you guys may remember this uh, bus. So this is where we're at on the back. It's all new stuff here. Make Man Monkey Store. I don't remember the Ferris wheel when I was there. Oh yeah. So this this whole place, I believe was built in 2001. Um, I mean, not all of it, it's expanded since, but I think prior to 2001, there was just like ocean here, right? That's when they reclaimed the land and did all that. This is like the whole new section. Or I guess it's not the newest section now, but... Yeah, this section has been here probably since... Because it wasn't here the first time I came, so maybe 2014, 2015, somewhere in there. And this is... Uh, that was... That hotel... Um, what was that? That was the tallest building in Okinawa for a long time. But now there's two, like twin tower types in Naha that are bigger. Oh, Kuya's watching. Hey, Chris. A lot of the information I'm spitting out I get from Kuya, so he could jump in here and tell you more about this place. There's Red, red Lobster. Okay, he breathed. Wait. Okay. Sorry, trying to show you guys. But there's Sega back there. Uh, oh, Bollywood, Jewel, if you guys like Bollywood. And here's the iconic street view of this. American Village. Depot Island was there since 2010. Okay, okay. Yeah, Depot Island was here the first time I came. The, but, like, the back side of it wasn't. Vessel Hotel on the right was there early as 2012 since I stayed there once or twice. I missed the Ferris wheel so much. 
far side of Depo Island appeared a few years later. Yeah, yeah. I was never old enough to drive off base when I graduated. I was 17. We yeah. rode buses everywhere. I had a, I had a few friends from Kadena High School that totally missed out on the, like, the Okinawan experience because they couldn't drive anywhere. Oh, yeah, Chris Oliver wants to connect with you and us, too. Which I'd like to. He lives in Ken, so that'd be cool. Have lunch or dinner or something sometime. Probably lunch. I want to. I really want to meet up with Joe before he has to PCS. Oh yeah, and Joe. It just sucks because well, everything's he's in stuck lockdown. now. Maybe we could do a social distance high. It's kind of our fault. We probably should have gone to some Pokemon raids with him. I, I know. Before everything shut down again. See, that's the problem. You always think you have time, and then stuff happens. Hilton was built in 2014. Yeah, that's right. I have two possibly emergency food. What was that? I have to possibly emergency poop. Got an emergency poop? Okay. We keep it really professional here, guys. <laughs> you do. I don't. Have I swear sore yet in this video? No, you haven't actually. See, I'm has away. has Kit cussed at all in this video because she's notorious for doing that in every video. <laughs> this might be a first, guys, if we get through this without her saying swear words. <laughs> oh, here, let me show you guys around since we're just parked. I'll at least show you yeah, some stuff. This is Four Seasons Steakhouse. I am doing that right now, Chris says. Pooping. Kyoto ramen. It's nice to know that some of you are watching us on the toilet. <laughs> it's comforting. <laughs> Very comforting. I'm glad you were that comfortable together. <laughs> Kyoto ramen. And behind us is a red car. <laughs> and there's a couple of Americans with masks. Because it's American Village. What? They may not have been, I don't know. Oh, it's starting they to rain. They were white. Oh boy. Rain's coming. You're in front of Camp Lester. Yep. That's Lester. That was Lester. That's where Kit was born. Lester Hospital. Lester Hospital. Lester name. I need some garlic house right about now. Oh, I know. Adin Kudin, right? Oh my gosh. That place is so good. I haven't been there since I got back. Try Seaside Terrace. Best French toast. We will have to, that's the one that's uh, the same person that owns um, Sam's by the Sea. Oh, really? He owns two, but I don't know if it's... Maybe it's not Seaside Terrace. I don't know. I need to connect with the guy who owns Sam's by the Sea. Because so many people have requested that video. Okinawa is primitive compared to what it is today. When he was there. Yeah. Yeah, I can see that. Okinawa has definitely changed. Oh, there's Goodwill. Oh, Goodwill. Ah. <laughs> Tried to show you. Someone was talking about it. You guys probably saw it anyway. Give our audience a whiplash. Yeah. <laughs> so Tinkaipin, this is uh, the best ramen place I've had in Okinawa. Yeah, you really like Tinkaipin. Specifically the Tan Tan Min. I don't know about the other ones, but Tan Tan Min was really good. Are they allowed? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, military members are not technically supposed to be out. Well, if anybody but, with SOFA status and military. Yeah, but that doesn't mean every white person is... I mean, I'm here. <laughs> we missed a place called Mickey's. Had the best yakisoba. People talk about Mickey's a lot, 
and Yucky Soup. I don't know if Mickey's is still around. Ray Payne oh, owns Chris. Sam's restaurant, as well as Rose Garden. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. Yeah, we showed Rose Garden earlier. Tacos and coffee. Chris, Ohio goes we still have to try American American. Oh, hey, Val. Is Lenny with you, too? Right now we're Thanks on for 58. Joining us. We just passed American Village. We're heading to the Tsunabe area. Yeah, we're just past American Village. I'm addicted to Tauntaun Men. Used to go there. Oh, yeah. The Tauntaun Men is so good. I love Tauntaun Men. Okinawa definitely ruined everything for me. I could not recover how good the food was in Japan. Now that I'm in the States, can't find a good sushi place. Oh man. Yeah, what what yeah. Uh, state are you in? Because I think it depends. Well, you know, I was, uh, I was watching an interview with Joji and he was saying that there was uh, the best, like the ex most expensive sushi in New York City uh -huh. still doesn't compare to the cheap sushi places at the train stations in Japan. Oh, really? Yeah, he's like, you can still get better sushi at train stations in Japan mm. than if you were to pay an arm and a leg in New York City for good sushi. Yeah, maybe like Japanese-style sushi. Yeah. See, I, I don't know. I don't consider American sushi... It's, it's like apples and oranges, you know? <laughs> They're not even the same thing. Yeah. I like this pizza in all you can eat pizza buffet. It's like one of my favorites. I know. I would pass. I wish. I wish Genghis Khan was still here. I would have loved to take you to Genghis Khan. Mickey's is on BC Street now. That's correct. Haven't found a good sushi place in New York. Because, I mean, California... I have to we... go now to finally eat something. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Congrats on 200 vlog. Thank you for singing me happy birthday. I'm so glad. <laughs> finally got to see another live. Have a great day. All right. Thanks, Nico. Thank you. Thank you for all the nice things you say. Um, what was it? Um, <laughs> yeah, because we lived in California. And... Uh, the sushi was okay. I mean, the American sushi was fine. But when it came to, like, the actual Japanese sushi with the pieces of fish on top of rice, it was not that good. And it was expensive. Like, well, some of the American sushi is excellent, but it's not Japanese sushi. No. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Like, it's a really good orange. But if you like apples, it's not you're not going to find a good apple yeah. eating oranges. You know what yeah. I mean? That's very true. And plus, like... When you get the two-piece sushi, it's four, like four dollars a plate for the cheapest one. So you're paying four dollars for two pieces. Of oh food. yeah, yeah. Right. California was ridiculously expensive. Yeah. Have fun, guys. Be safe. Thank you. You guys be safe too. Wait. Into the yeah. <laughs> that was definitely a moment of. <laughs> be safe. No, it's like. I mean that makes sense. Oh yeah. I don't know. <laughs> been to bowling alley on Kadena, have taco rice, sushi socks in the states. Socks. Socks. Uh, <laughs> socks. Yes, I see. Kadena. You have socks. <laughs> Kadena so bowling socks. alley had the best grilled cheese sandwich. Oh, really? I used to go to the Kadena bowling alley just for their grilled cheese sandwich. Oh, wow. If I could still get on base, I would probably go to the bowling alley for their grilled cheese sandwich. Take it. This is uh, the Seaside Inn. Seaside Inn. Or the Kadena Marina Seaside Inn. Kadena Marina Seaside Inn. Oh, right there. Yeah, that's a restaurant. Okay, okay. Um, that's, looks like it's closed. There was, there was a car maybe. And then over here, I'm going to turn left here, but um, there's KFC and then this is Shakey's. This is the Naval Kadena which is also like an old shopping center prior to like Mihama and stuff like that. Mm. I used to come to Naval Kadena all the time when I was a kid. 
but it's all run down now. Oh, yeah. I'd like to know while you guys are here, do you guys enjoy um, the drives? Or would you rather have us go to a specific destination? Or do you just want like a mix of both? Because the drives we kind of just see a lot, you know. But we don't really like in detail see a lot of stuff. We just kind of drive by. Well, the other day we went to Ryukyu Village. Ryukyu. Yeah. We'll probably continue to keep doing a mix. But yeah. uh, as this virus ramps up here, we might start doing more drives again. Yeah. Yeah. Don't have to get out of the car or expose ourselves really to anything. Just drive well, around. Well, we started doing the drives because of that. Yeah, we did start the drives because of that, and they became very popular. I'm actually, Anthony loved the drives. I'm actually really glad that we went to Shuri Castle before all the coronavirus ramped up again in Okinawa. Oh, there's Ray. Have you just got here, Ray? I haven't, I don't think I've seen him comment yet. Welcome. Used to be a Toys R Us there. Oh, yes. is this where that Toys R Us was? There, well, there, there was an, there was a old Toys R Us that was here. The only Toys R Us left on the island is actually in Rycom Mall, I believe. I don't think Parco has one. It might be the only Toys R Us left in the world. Uh, Maybe? No. Just kidding. I doubt it. There's not any in America, though, right? Or there's... They were gonna start reopening them? I don't know if they ever did, though. Oh my god, you guys are really close to my home. Yeah. Oh, really? I'm actually trying to get to Sanabe, which is this area right here. If you're home now, you come out to the street and wave to everyone and yourself <laughs> for watching. Well, Dorothy lives around here too. Oh yeah, I miss Daiso, both, the whole deal, whatever is fine, mix up. So, so this is the Sanabe area. I was thinking maybe we could get out and see the ocean here. Can you guys get on Lester? So that's one thing uh, we probably, Sunset. unless we get specific permission, which I doubt they'll give us, we're not gonna do any videos on the bases. Because, because there's like major like security, security and, and stuff, stuff like that, yeah. for military. Here, you wanna go check out the ocean? Unless, I mean, we get big enough, we might be able to like fill out contracts and stuff to, Okay, so as you can see, yeah, we sorry. are parked. This is the Kadena Sea Walnut Sanabe. Okay. Do you want me to add you? You're watching? Let's try the split screen thing. Here, I'm gonna... Oh, I can't add you. No, I don't need to split screen. Oh, you just left. Okay. Oh, are you coming out too? Oh, let me get my uh, phone case back on. 